Hello there, everybody, and welcome back to Fade to Silence. So, we are going to be going to that ship today, but what we are also going to do is try something, and that's what the level 2 fur looks like. That is absolutely badass. Alright, so, before I go in, I must do something. These are fire arrows, supernatural arrows that set your foes ablaze. This guy. Excuse me, pendejo. Ooh. Ow! Okay, yep, yep. Don't know how to fight you. Oh, what the shit? What the hell? Okay, so these are working. Kind of. I'll take the primitive arrows, because I have no idea. Oh, he can follow me. Oh, he can follow me. Oh, what the hell? Oh, what the hell? Oh, what the double hell? Oh, hello! Okay, um... So... He's got that weird red web thing. Okay, okay, okay. Okay, so this seems to be working. Somewhat. I'm curious. Oh! Okay. 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 Okay, uh, we're doing it. We're doing it. Oh my god, how am I not taking damage? I will totally go with the um, I should be taking damage group. Dark Souls for the win, bitch. Okay, so level two sword and you can kick his ass. I should have done this earlier. Nope, nope, no, no, no. Okay, 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 okay. Nope, nope, nope. Run away, run away. Oh, come on! Yeah, 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 yeah. I know, you're right there. Yeah, 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 yeah. Shut up. Ugh. Okay, I get it, I get it, I get it. You're mean, you're angry. I get it, I get it. Holy shit. Hold on, what? Whoa! That's not working. Oh, okay, you guys are just getting angry at him. Okay, that's that's good, that's good. How about some rank 2 arrows? Are these gonna work? Oh, whoa, 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 no! Really? Can primitive arrows actually work on him with a level 2 bow? Nope. Woohoo! No, wrong way, you stupid game! Oh, good lord. Come on. Whoa. Okay. 
You had a flame of hope on you too, though. That was wicked. So, a level 2 sword can actually kick the crusher's ass. As well as level 2 arrows, so we know how to beat him now. Hold on, is it actually stacked? Oh, my healing thing was stacked. Okay, cool. So, what was he guarding? What was he guarding? Okay. Was he actually guarding anything good, or is it just like... Crap, like usual. Okay. Well, I mean, nothing is useless in this game. Let's be honest, everything has a use. Good! Craft it! I need it! Okay, so... Typical standard stuff. We have stuff all over the place in here. Holy crap, this is just a big treasure trove. I am so not complaining right now. Oh my goodness gracious, great balls of fire. Okay. So then we got this. Lots of healing items, that's good. Oop. But he at least gives you... Oh, would you just stop? If I can find... If I could find an iron node after I get my next level pick, I am going to be having so much fun. I don't mind primitive arrows. Most normal enemies can handle being hit by a primitive arrow. Wakey, wakey! Okay, so there's that bag there, but... There's also this path up here. That I saw. Just around the corner. Oh no, this was the path just around the corner. Oh, I am dumb some days. It really doesn't take you that long to craft leather, does it? So what do we got here? Hello. You're unique, aren't you? You're gonna wake up when I unlock this. Or when I'm working on unlocking it, of course. Hi, you're just a ripper. You guys are not even that scary anymore. Your green brother is worse. Alright, grab this. I'm really not complaining about the stuff I'm getting. It is good stuff that I can take back to base and craft materials with. But I mean, that Crusher had the best thing. He had a Flame of Hope. That's given me even more chances to beat this thing and then I can play through it all over again, which will be fun. Okay, so there it is. There it is, yes. Okay. So, that being all said and done, isn't there? Yes. Alright, this cave has officially been cleaned out. That was amazing. I am going to cut off my recording here. I am going to go back to base, store all that stuff. Rest at base until the attack comes. Because the attack is very, very close. And then, after the assault, which will ultimately fail, I guarantee you that. I will be uh, going and exploring the ship. 
because that, I mean, it gets pointed out in the very beginning of the game. As basically, there must be plenty of food there, Dad. So, there's bound to be some goodies. I imagine there will be food. I'm not going to say how much, because we are going to discover this together. But yeah, I'll get myself home. Probably flip my sled a few times, like I said. And, uh, yeah. I'll see you at the defense of my base. I tried to rest. It's not going to bring the attack any quicker. So, we are going to go and mess up. And I didn't pick up the arrows outside the tentacle tower. Turned out, it was a lot of the goody arrows. Explosives and fire. Which, as we saw, were amazing against the crusher. I could have been more patient, but... Ooh, a quickening shard. Okay. Good job, Ghani. I need more of that stuff. All right, we're going up and up and up. So let's just look at the map. Yep, we're going up and up and up towards the ship. I'm not taking the dogs simply because I have no idea if they'll be able to get up here, let alone get me down with relative ease. I might have to waste a flame of hope just jumping down. Well, that's neat. Shut up, bird. If I could, I'd cook you. You stay out of here, you giant testicle. Ooh, what'd I find? Quickening shard. What are you going to give me? Yeah, like I'm going to believe the guy that wants to choke the world. Wow, I'm at the ship. I wonder if I'm going to find that weird tentacle monster again. Stop it. I do get the slight feeling it is my... Uh... Ooh, revitalizing shard. What am I at for those? Nice. My stamina's better and my health is one shard away from being kick-ass. Ooh, another quickening shard. Me likey. One more and that'll be even better. Okay. Your followers are seeking shelter from a... Really? There's going to be a blizzard? So, okay, so I, what? I see shards. That's what I'm happy about. Quickening shard. Flame of hope. Revitalizing shard. 
Convulsing bit. Quickening shard. Okay. Yeah, that toy horse is what I'm looking for. Found a toy for Elledge. It's now on display in your refuge. Selenito. I can teleport to the cargo ship. Okay, that makes me happy that I can go to the cargo ship. So I'm going to teleport back and forth, grabbing everything, because that's just fan-freaking-tastic. That's a lot of resources right there, I guarantee it. Wait, what? That was it. Why do I not have firewood? Why do you guys not have... How do you keep running out of firewood? This is seriously the only thing that bothers me. Is that they keep running out of firewood. Okay, so... Can we finish up the blizzard, please? Thank you. Like, gin is freezing, rhyme is freezing. Yo, if you idiots would actually, like, cleanse the wood, you know? Like, that would be fantastic, too. Uh, you know, I'm just not going to argue. Okay. Okay. Now, I've got this flame of hope that I'm going to swallow. What's up? Isaac, my husband. He was ill. He just wasted away, dying bit by bit. When the monsters appeared, he said he'd rather be. Remedy I'd ever heard of, any cure I could trade for. I was desperate. But Isaac and I, we, we found a kind. Just three survivors. Not nice people, kind. I hunted, did the work of two people, or tried to. If we could just stay there long enough. Then I heard the other survivors die. Late. How they had to get rid of us. Couldn't blame them. That night, I slit their throats. One by one. <clears throat> Drag their bodies into the forest. Isaac. He knew what I'd done when he looked at me. But I still had him. Had the supplies. We'd stay in one place and he'd be all right. But two days later, that's when we were attacked. Ooh. Mm -hmm. 
You know, I don't know if I can blame her. I mean, she did that to save her husband. I, I don't know if I can fault her for that. Okay, do I have anybody crafting the, like, processing the wood? Oh, they finished. No wonder. Um. Yeah, you need to, um. Camp is under attack. My crystal will kick your ass. No, Impaler. Oh, very good, you guys. Oh, we got Rippers. Hey, get back here. Okay, the camp is out of firewood. I have to take care of this a little bit first. Because I'm not going to let them freeze. I wonder if one of the spoons that I actually am able to get will increase my crafting speed myself. Because that would help me save so much time. Okay, that should be enough wood for now. You guys should be able to no longer freeze. At least I'd like to hope so. Store that. Now let's go see what goodies those chests give, even though... The chests never really seem to give that many goodies. <laughs> Okay. What do we got? Is that it? Pristine wood in that one. Okay. Firewood and primitive arrows. Yo, game. Let me... Can you... Thank you. little bit better. Oh, he's depleted a hunting ground. Well, good for you, boy. Okay, so from what I can see, didn't really give me as much as I would like. Hmm. 
kind of evil. All of that. Like, he gave me all the shards. I am not complaining about the shards I obtained. No, 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 no. Quite the opposite. I was just expecting... Actually, I don't even know what I was expecting. Okay. Now, we're in an area that has a lot of goodies, though not resources. What we need to do is start moving ahead again. I've cleared out a lot of area, and there could be shards around here that I am unaware of. And those shards definitely help. Every area helps, given the amount of crap that's in each white dot. Oh, yeah. Hey, you get out of here, you eclipse. I don't care, I'm still going to call it the giant testicle for the sake of argument, because, let's face it, it looks like a giant friggin' testicle. Ghani is too tired and will go rest. Hmm. Store that... Okay. Now I know I don't have enough food to get me by, but that is okay. We're going to explore this area a little bit to see if this area in general was worth it. Every little nook and cranny, every little crate is what I want to do. Though, next episode we will be moving forward a little bit. I just want to delay a little bit of time so that um, the others can level up a bit. Six pieces of... So okay, this area might be a very nice boon. Okay, I see a lot of stuff I still have to gather, because I kind of ran through here. So I do kind of want to finish the exploration bits. Yeah, I'll take the firewood. My place is very low on firewood, given everyone keeps running... Oh... Okay. Hello? Oh, it's just you. And he's moving past. I'm okay with that. Give me them arrows. Does he actually light up? No, he doesn't. I was kind of hoping he would. That would have been cool. I don't know why I think that would have been cool, but it would have been cool. There is a shard on there. Can I grab it? Yes, I can. Quickening shard. Hello. I'll take that. All plants are useful. All plants are useful. Well, that's inside the building there. Okay, let's mosey around, see what we can find, see what we can see. Hello, hello. It's too bad you couldn't actually send your survivors out with you. Like, admittedly, I could be bringing them with me to aid me in all this. And I'm not saying don't do it. Honestly, do it. What is it that I'm looking at over there? It must just be right there, but it looks like it's got a bunch of crystals. Good, you guys have recovered from hypothermia! I'm impressed! Not really, you guys are idiots and you should prioritize cleansing wood. You shouldn't need me.
I wonder where it happens when I get to the end. Like that, I am very curious about. Um, okay. What is down this direction? I see a bag. I see a garbage bag of what I dumped. Nice, and I got one slot left, okay. What is that? Okay, it's just an Eldridescence. Oh, that must be from one of the zits that I popped. Okay. Well. There's my pups. Okay, so boom. There we go. I have one more crystal so I can just walk down, and that's what I intend on doing. This is relaxing to me. Alright. Call on the site again. For the things above me that I have missed, I can grab another time. I'm more curious what's down here. Whee! Because there's no areas for me to chop wood or anything, and the areas that I passed, I couldn't chop the wood because I needed the copper axe, which I now have. And not to mention, this is basically killing time so that uh, my companions can earn some trust in me. Is my stamina actually recovering faster, or... Honestly, I can't tell if it is or isn't, so we'll see. What do we got in this purse? Not bad, not bad. A health shard in the shitter. That is, that is fantastic. <laughs> I wonder if it'll do something weird, like if you clear everything out, that you can restart the game and your flames of hope can be turned into boons. That'd be kind of cool. Decent stuff. Unlock. I'm at least getting plenty of healing items this time. Is that a crusher? That is a crusher. Well, holy shit burger. Oh, well. I'm not gonna have you creeping up my asshole. Mm -mm. Not happening. Okay, buddy? I'm gonna come over here and smack you like a little bitch. Alright, that's another golem. I got plenty of healing poultices. Yo, 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 what it is? Oh, yep, that's gonna happen. Come get some. Come get some, boy. 
Oh, hell yeah. Want some more? Come on, you want some of this? Nope, gotta wait until he's bringing the hammer down. Oh, shit, what the hell? Okay, he's got a certain distance that he's able to go to. I can use that to my advantage, at least. I'm going to take advantage of this bugging out. I know it's cheap skating. I honestly just don't care. I'm going to lower his health down as much as I can. Hey, you process them tainted remains. Come on, big boy. You got stuck. Oh. No, that's gross. Ah, oh, that that came. Yep, 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 yep. Yeah, you can walk over that now, can you? Oh, yep, 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 Get the hell up. I surrender. I surrender to the almighty crusher. Because he's an idiot. Um... Yeah, my inventory's looking good. Yo, uh, dude, you okay? Yo, Crusher, you okay? The fact that you're bugging out like this is fantastic for me. I have eight flames of hope. I got eight flames of hope. I am so not screwed. <laughs> oh, this is fantastic. I will say this, though. I will say this. If my followers die, I'm going to be sad. Because I will not be able to actually do anything with them anymore. Won't be able to craft anything fantastic. And for all I know, the end boss is going to require a lot of high-end goodies to beat up. Is that seriously all you were guarding? Really, buddy? Really? Like, really, really? That was all you were guarding? Really? Okay, there's the Veiled Creep. Let's come over here, see what's over here. How much of this... There is a lot to this area that I have to explore. Uh, I've been going on for quite a while, though, so... Thank you, Ryan. You are doing very good. Okay, um... Uh, next white dot in range is just over here. I am doing this to find the shards, by the by. I honestly think it'll be wicked to find all the shards. Though it's going to take a lot of exploring. 
Like, you would have to scour every single white dot. But at least we know, first pass through the game is very, very useful in order to actually get to the ship because of the shards that are there. Like, there's a lot. I probably didn't even find all of them. Okay, I see the... Okay, yeah, I see what's over there that's causing me to not clear this area. What else is there? What am I missing that's making me not clear the area? I'm not seeing anything, so... Yeah, I'm not seeing anything that would help me. Oh. Can I get up there from here? No, I'm going to have to go around. That There's an airplane up there. I didn't even notice it. Oh, man, I am blind. I'm going to do that airplane. And then I'm going to... What? What, what, what? Those are normally just around uh, the zits I like to pop. Yo. Hey, Ripper. Can't have my soul today, though, sir. Good night. Why is this red creep stuff here? I don't think it's of any um, importance that it's still here, but... And you are also a pain in my ass. You're creepy, dude. You're a very creepy dude. Okay. I'm going to eat that food. I'm going to unlock this. Man, he is just creepier than shit, isn't he? Nice try! Jackass. Okay, guess I can't take it. Now what's up here? I'm taking the Undying Ember, I don't care. My puppies! That means I'm... Yes, I'm right next to it. I'll be able to go home. I'll be able to go home, check on everybody. See if I've leveled up with another survivor. And, um... You know, I think that's where I'm going to leave it off. I can always come and explore these areas more later. If need be. I mean, I can. It's a lot of Elder Jessence I missed. Just need to get to that crystal, please, and thank you. But are there any shards that I can see in my visione that I have missed? Not that I can see. Not that I can see. Though I see an undying ember. 
<laughs> um. So what I might do after I sign off for the day, let me just teleport and I'll map it out for you on the actual map of what I'm going to do off camera, just because I understand that these can get boring if I'm just dinking around going to the white dots, but at least it's informative of what's there. And let's face it, I need all the help I can get. Anyway, any hoodle doodle without the little noodle. As I like to say. Are you guys seriously out of friggin' wood again? So, Rascal, what did you get up to while I was gone? Ah. Uh, I'ma get pissed. What do you think you're gonna find out? Yeah, you can't touch me. I'm in my home base. <laughs> okay. You didn't finish that pickaxe, did you? No, you didn't. But you got the pristine leather. Yeah, I just need the backpack. But to get the backpack, I am missing... Purified Essence. Which is horrible. So what I need is this place to be finished. He's the only one that can do it. But I need imbued lumber, imbued leather, so, Rascal, and copper parts. He's also very weird, sweetheart. He's also very weird. But now that we're back, I'm going to quickly use my wolf crystal. I'm going to come in here because I think the copper parts are in here. Yes, they are. Okay. And I need ingots. All right. Um, I'm going to remove that. One more of those. Four of those. Perfect. Okay. Then I can make imbued lumber here, right? I need imbued wood. I need imbued wood. How do you make imbued wood? I'm going to need it through here, right? Hmm. Yeah, I can turn lumber into regular firewood if I need to. But this is where this comes in. Like, presently, Vic would be able to do this. I just have to get the writhing wood. And that's what I'm going to go out there and find myself. So she's going to keep doing this. I'm going to go and explore this area of the map here to give you an idea what I'm doing. I'm going to teleport here, and then I'm going to gather these resource nodes. And then I will teleport here, and I will gather all of these resource areas. And next episode, we will press forward into the next area here. And it looks like there's only two tentacle towers left. But yeah, we'll be coming here next. So that is the plan of attack for my night. I hope you all enjoyed. If there's anything particular you would love to see me do, by all means, feel free to leave me a comment. If you want me to, for some odd reason, die a lot, so that I can start over and get myself some new goodies, I don't really want to. <laughs> In all fairness, I don't really want to. But yeah, all in all, that's what I'm going to be doing. I'm going to go knock some resource nodes down. 
and enjoy it. But I hope you all enjoyed, and I will see you next time for more madness of popping zits and clearing areas. Bye.